Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am in Sarkson and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're jumping back into Sailor Moon Crystal, which is season 3, episode 31, called Act 30, Infinity 4. Hakura and Mitrisu. I'm probably butchering that again. So basically, we start off, they want to tell them or work with them. So this is Cell Uranus and Neptune are like, hmm, we're not sharing. Bye. And they shouldn't be there. And then Mamoru had a dream. And Usagi did too. And then we have Hakura surprises Usagi. And Mamoru interrupts. And then she starts crying. Because she's got that jealousy stuff. And then we cut to Ritubi Yusuf creating the Holy Grail. And it was her mother's. And then she starts to cry again. Then we have awkwardness between Usagi and Mamoru. And then we have Chibi interrupts. And so they help her with her project. And then the awkwardness between Usagi and Mamoru resolved. And she was actually kind of playing that because she's actually like over like 600 years old. So she's, you know, she's got it covered. Then we cut to where um, Usagi's in class and talks to Mako and Ami about prep school and decided to go there. And then uh, these things picture the crap out of me. Uh, I want to say Uwe Beto um, offers Ami a trial enrollment and so she goes to the set room and to the science room and sees a recreated star system and it's a Tau system and then Uwe wants her to um, wants her to be a host but Ami senses danger and she runs for it. Uwe traps her and then have her Kura and Ichiryu help her and they have a really cool fight scene and the Skype the scouts come to help out and then you have the daemon attacks and then Hakura and Mitsurisu transform and they got rid of her and they leave and then the girl talks to um, the new um, student for I want to say biology and it's Setsuno who is also Sailor Pluto and that was in the episode. I give this A plus. I really, really, really enjoyed the episode. And we get to see Setsuno, who's just Sarah Polito, which is probably one of my favorite characters in the um in the classic anime. Uh when I was watching it as a kid or preteen, where it came out, I had a crush on her. So I really, really liked her. Um, I thought she was a really good character and um I think it's interesting to see her in the real world and um and not really guarding the gate. So she got reborn, which was super cool. Good for her. But they did that kind of fast because, like, she went bye-bye in the last season. So, like, that was uh, quick. <laughs> but anyway, I really, really enjoyed the, um, the fight scene and the storyline. I think it's kind of interesting because they are following the enemy from what I remember. I'm actually re-watching it, but I only watched like two episodes, so <laughs> I haven't seen it in forever, so anyway, I'm doing that for as well on the channel, so that'll be up, I don't know. I have no idea when, but it's coming up soon. Anyway, um, really enjoyed it. That's one of the this video, so if you liked this video, please go to like, comment down below, tell me what you think of the episode, do you agree, disagree, tell me your thoughts down below. Don't forget to subscribe because it does help out the channel a lot. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye, everybody.